All right, um, today is Friday, December 31st, the last day of the year. Um, this is going to be a year end synopsis of my portfolio for 2021. Somebody had asked me how much I started off with my investment. So I started off with around approximately 4700 That was um, last year, April, when um, the market crashed. So that's around what I started off with approximately. Um, I added some money. Okay, this is going to be... Alright, this is the S&P 500 for this year. Uh, it's up 27.8% for the year. This is usually the um, the gauge of the market. So the S&P did 27% this year. Which is pretty good. Um... Okay. Okay, this is today. I lost two hundred dollars. Two hundred and thirty thirty one dollars today. It's been a it's been a pretty bad month for me. I lost a lot of money. Like um almost like twenty five hundred twenty five hundred dollars. Um I made a big mistake. I was chasing um, 50, 50K and I took a big risk and it didn't pan out. So yeah, I, I took a big loss um, this month. But I don't plan on adding any money to my account for a while. Cause I made some um, portfolio rearrangements and I want to see what they're gonna do before I add money to my account. So I'm gonna let it, I'm gonna let it sit 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 off a little bit before I add any money to my account. And my year is gonna be twenty two point six five percent. So I didn't beat S and P. I missed it by um, was it seven percent? So I, I did 22.6%. It could have been more if I hadn't taken that risk. I would have been at um, around 30%, but I took a risk and it didn't pan out. So, um, yeah, we'll see what happens next year. Next year should be good because, like I said, I rearranged some stuff, so I want to see those. Um, stocks appreciate in value so we'll see what in the, what 2022 brings hopefully I don't make the same mistake twice could it say a person who makes the same mistake expecting a different results is crazy so I don't want to be crazy but yeah but the main thing is your emotions. Take your emotions out of it. I'm still learning that part. You know. Because everybody want to wanna get rich. So. So that's my um, year-end stock analysis. If you have any questions, let me know.